Uh, Mr. Secretary, I did. I, I didn't plan to speak about it. I think it's very important as somebody who was in those circumstances, um, and actually it relates to my next question about about a month ago, I was in Nashville where I, I spent my, my junior high and high school years, and I went road, always do a trip down memory lane, go to the places I lived. I lived in a trailer park there. And I went to Sugarcane Lane, which was the uh, trailer park I lived in, and took a picture of the, the trailer. And it made me think about uh, manufactured housing, and it made me think about people who, when I, I ended up having to live there, I moved out of the trailer park, moved back, bought my own. I lived there with my family first. And, you know, it, I don't think that most people recognize that the regulatory burden that we place on the citizens of the United States hit the, the, the poorest among us the hardest. Mm -hmm. And if you're buying a mobile home and you're buying manufactured housing and you've got to go through the morass of regulations that we have today, there's no doubt that you're creating a higher price point. Absolutely. In my case, it could be the difference between a single wide and a single wide with a bump out. Um, but what are you doing, and that, um, that's more of a, 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 a blade level, so you may not be able to answer the question specifically, but it's one example of regulatory streamlining and regulatory relief that I think we need to focus on, and there are a number of others. Can you I'm glad shed you some brought, light on that? I'm glad you brought that up. Um, you know, manufactured housing accounts for 10% of single family dwellings, 22 million households. Uh, so it is substantial. Uh, and it is actually a potential solution for some of the housing issues, particularly in rural areas. If you look at the progress that has been made in manufactured housing recently, it's amazing. In fact, a lot of the housing, you would not be able to distinguish from site-built housing, and yet the pricing is better. But the uh, regulation, regulations are ridiculous. So, you know, we put a moratorium on that. We're inspecting from top to bottom all of those regulations right now and uh, getting rid of a lot of them because I think this is an area where we can uh, take advantage.